In this video, we're gonna take a look at how to customize the, uh, the color spectrums and the times on your light fixture. Uh, in this case, we do have a group that has one fixture in it called Freshwater, and then we've also got the, uh, another light fixture that we've just labeled the individual fixture as Cichlid Tank. So to access the programming, you just wanna tap on it uh, quickly once, uh, where it says uh, Cichlid Tank, and then that'll bring up the, uh, the screen that actually shows uh, the different spectrums and the, the ramping up and down. Now to access from here, the programming, just right in the middle of the graph area, tap on it once with your finger and it'll open up the, uh, the programming. Um, now to program, you, you can see where the time point is at. There's a little circle right underneath where it says PM and there's a gray circle. What you do to change the time points is you use these um, buttons that have like the two arrows to the left or the two arrows to the right. And that'll allow you to toggle to the different time points. So you can see I keep arrowing to the left and I'm just scrolling through here. So that's how you actually get onto a time point. And then once you're on the tom time point, you can take and just stretch, stretch the time point however you like. So now we've, uh, we've moved this one to 1238. Um, you can also, if you wanted to just enter a, a specific time, you can tap on the 38 up above, and then you can just uh, scroll to whatever time you actually want, and then tap off of it, and uh, it'll move the graph to that time. Now, it, say for instance, we've moved uh, this time point now we want to go to the next time point. We can just hit the right arrow over and it'll move to the next time point. And then we can drag again, tapping on the gray dot. We can just drag it to whatever time we want. So we can change this to 425. Okay, let's say we, we don't want to just toggle between these time points, but we want to add a new time point. To do that, you would use the little plus. So you would select plus. And then let's key in the time that we want to have our time point. Let's say we want it to be at, at 7 a.m. Okay. Now with it at 7 a.m., if you go down below, you can see where you've got like the, uh, the red, yellow, the gray. So you can just slide this to the right and you'll actually create that time point or the, the colors for that time point. Okay, when you're all done, you just wanna go up to the top right and hit save. Now you can go back to toggling between these so we could actually toggle over to this time point and we could modify this one if we would like. Okay, we can hit save. So really your, your creation of time points is endless. Um, we hit the play button and this would actually uh, allow the lights to cycle through so you could see what the light uh, would look like when it's ramping up and ramping down and the combinations of colors.